I think I've got the sanding done. Now, my plan is to write faith, hope, and love on one on each plate. And then I looked up some Christian symbols. I'm going to try and just pencil in the letters and then the symbol. And if they look okay, and I don't have to erase or wash off anything. <laughs> then I will go over them with a Sharpie. I don't trust myself to hold a paintbrush that still. <laughs> or that evenly. So. Thing is wanting to know where to start here. Which end to... This looks like a little higher end. It's going to be a little cumbersome because of all the scallops. I is the middle letter, so... Looks centered. I don't know if this is scallops or what got centered. Okay, I think that one is. I think that one's the anchor. This one seems to have more of a lower end than these do. bigger than that.
So that's, I don't know if you can really see that very well, but I've got faith, which is anchored. Hope is a sign of the fish. And love is a heart behind the cross, or a cross through the heart. So, <laughs> I'm going to try and do these with a Sharpie. I've got several colors of Sharpie, but, and then I've got another trick I want to do. Here goes. Okay. Well, I need it. <laughs> I need to figure out how they do that. People work right under the camera. Okay. Even a sharpie, you gotta be, <laughs> you gotta be careful because that one seems to wanna. Well, it hasn't smeared. It just was a little wider than I thought. Uh-oh. Yeek. All it needs with me is one mistake. Okay. Be careful where my pen's going. Faith, hope. Sure, that's good and dry. There's a bump there.
Okay, we got faith, hope, and love. So, <laughs> let me know what you think. I've got one more trick up my sleeve that I'm going to do. I got a gift from my daughter a couple years ago. It's called glitter glue. Okay, disclaimer. We all do know Glenda does not do perfect, right? Linda does the best that she can. I'm really trying to do the best that I can. Here we go. You need to see what I'm doing. All right, this is what I'm doing. <laughs> Can you see that at all with the glitter glue on it? That gold. And it's not dry and I'm turning the bowl or the dish and getting it all over me. But I must continue. I don't think these hold as much as I thought they did. Or they've just got a lot of air holes in them. Looky there. Looks like I took a lot of it off of them. That end right never had it on there good. It was at the beginning of the... Ah! I'm trying to wipe the glue, glitter glue off my hands. I'm going to wait till I'm not on camera to do the others and then I'll show you later what they're like. Okay. There it is. There they are. All glittered. And done. Let me know what you think. I know a few of you have given me some project ideas that maybe I should work on. I guess I have to go back and look and see what they were. <laughs> I get kind of caught up. This is the crafts part of Freelands and Friends Crafts Plus. This is one of the crafts parts. <laughs> so I hope you like these. Whoever gets them, I hope they like them too. I like the gold, gold glitter. If it'll stay in place, we're going to let them dry. <laughs> not touching them we're just gonna let them dry and then hopefully when Joe goes to put the shellac on or the finish coat on it'll seal that in please subscribe click the notification bell give us a thumbs up <laughs> and please come back and when you're out and about smile and wave say hey I like you. I see you. You're a person and I like you. And I love all of you. So I will see you. Oh wait, this goes up to my, okay. I'll see you Monday. Hopefully bright and cheery. <laughs> With some done dishes. Good night.